office. This is a tower before it's in, e erected. This is the tower erected on the ground. Then you pull up the base section. You pull this up, bolt it down, and then you move the pulley block to the top to lift the, raise the tower. There is the winch with the hydraulic cylinder to get it to go over center and to receive it on the way back down. There's the wind turbine. And there's the wind turbine with ice on the blades. Here's a solar install that we did. Screwing in anchors. Uprighting the, or installing the uh, mass pipe and putting the inverter and the base can on the top. Here you see three, uh, six mass pipes with in, uh, inverters and base cans on the top. That's all six of them. And here's the rack and assembly on the solar tracker. That's an all sun tracker is what it is. And here we are, we're putting the panels on the, on the racking. There is the finished product. They're flat when, uh, uh, when there's no power. The electrician is digging the trench to wire it. And here they are functioning after they're commissioned. And like I said, most products we use are made in the United States. Not all of them, but most of them. And here we go with this. This is how you service the car. You take the telehandler and you buck underneath of it, chain it on, and you raise it up. There's not even a post in the way. Real handy. And here's a couple more pictures. Woodmaster outdoor boiler. Wood boiler. A solar hot water system on the roof of the building here. Warm air collectors on each side of the aircraft hangar. And then we have some evacuated tubes on a project not too far from here that we uh, expanded. All kinds of little things happening around here.